Assalamu alaikum beautiful people we are back with another video and in this video we will talk about the biggest flash sale in FC Mobile when it is coming and how to prepare for this flash sale uh, as you know for the flash sale we just need uh, gems and FC points which will help us to open a lot of packs and we will get better rewards as compared to uh, the event reward so watch this video till the end and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel as you know new event anniversary is coming in the FC Mobile after the end of the Retro Stars event and this event will be available in the game on 25 September. So as we already know uh, the event flow like there will be quest uh, after that challenges, top exchanges, special thanks, calendar and best offers 200% uh, and flash sale. So in this video we will talk about the best offers 200% and flash sale. So for both we need gems and FC points to open the packs. Uh, for example right now uh, if any pack is giving you good rewards with 100% probability uh, in the best offers we will uh, get 200% offers with better rewards and those packs will be cheaper as well and not only that there will be flash sale uh, if you are playing the game uh, from the uh, FIFA mobile uh, seasons you know like uh, in every one month or after two months we got flash sale in which uh, we have to use our gems or fc points to open the packs and after that we got a lot of good rewards uh, there were uh, some special uh, black friday uh, sale offers as well or for the or the sale offers for the special players like i still remember a flash sale offer for uh, pele in which we have to open a lot of packs and at the end we got pele but it was for the p2p guys uh, f2p didn't got pele we only got him from the market and uh, there were some uh, separate uh, offers for the F2Ps as well, like limited offers, but those offers were not good. So if this uh, flag sale is coming in the FC Mobile and it's also coming alongside anniversary event, so we can expect the OVR will be one or two or one or three and all the, uh, the anniversary players will be available alongside the uh, flash. Uh, all the players will be available in this flag sale from the anniversary event. Uh, when it is coming, now this is the main uh, question, right now still 16 days are remaining are remaining in the end of the Retro Stars event and uh, as you know when the anniversary will be launched, uh, flash sale will not be available immediately, it will come after probably one week or two weeks. So let's just aim like flash sale will come in the FC Mobile uh, after one month, then how much uh, coins or gems we can make on free uh, as an F2P and I will tell you every detail like from where you will get three gems and how you can get them. So now let's move towards that. Talking about the anniversary event, uh, they, as you know, logo of the anniversary event is already been released by the FC Mobile because as you know, there is a community challenge for the logo and you can see one anniversary and also in the gifts, uh, in the daily login gifts, there are five uh, login rewards are available which suggest one which means anniversary uh, and there are few other leaks as well this is probably a concept in which you can see a one or three OVR Yasin Charlatan uh, card uh, there is Socrates Messi uh, Bellingham Mbappe at the one or three Neymar Jr and Florentine Wits at the one or two and one or one Kim Min J so this is just a concept but in the anniversary event we can expect a, a one or three OVR because uh, that will be the first event of FC Mobile so we are just getting 101 OVR one OVR cards again and again so we can expect some um, higher rewards in the future and right now the F2P rewards are 99 and maximum 100 but we can expect 101 to 103 OVR F2P rewards or 101 to 103 F2P milestone in the anniversary event which will be enough for us so share your thoughts like uh, what should be the limit of OVR in the anniversary event. So now let's talk about uh, gems how much we can make uh, in the daily quest we earn 410 gems daily from only quest 150 from these three and also we get additional from these three uh, milestones and if we complete it for the 28 days as i was telling you that uh minimum it uh die sale will take one month and if it's coming at the end of the retro stars event then probably we will get more time and we will make more gems but in this video i will only talk about 28 days so in 28 days we will get 11480 gems from this uh, section and weekly we are also getting gems so here you can see 200 
uh, from here, 200 from here, and 200 from here as well. So 600, and for the four weeks, we will get 2,400 gems from this section. After that, from the retro quest, we can also get 200 gems for free. So let's just count that. Uh, if you move towards the store uh, in the gem section, there is a daily ad which gives us 300 uh, gems. I will suggest you to watch it daily because this will help you to get 2,800 gems in a month. After that, let's move towards the events, like how much uh, gems we can get from the events in the Retro Stars event in the intro section. There are 1,000 gems for free for us in the week 2, which we already claimed. After that, if you will move towards uh, the Retro Rewards, here you will see that this section will give us 1,000 gems with only spending 200 Retro Tickets. Uh, I will suggest you first get the Premium Rewards and not spend them on these types of rewards. And in the 4 weeks, we will get uh, 4,000 gems for free. Uh, because in the week 1, week 2, week 3, week 4, there are gems available. After that, uh, we have to move towards the Retro uh, Challenge Mode as well. As you know, there is a Daily Challenge Mode. And if you will complete it daily, you will be able to get 100 gems. And in the 28 days, we will get 2,800 2, gems from this section. There are no gems from the weekend. So it depends upon you. Either you want to complete it or uh, not. After that, as you know, we are playing uh, Icons Chronicles event and that that is only giving us universal tokens. So we can spend it uh, on this offer which is available in the Division Rival stores, this Gems Limited offer. I think this refreshes up in every week. So let's just say in one week we are getting 2,500. In four weeks, you will get 10,000 gems from this section. And if we combine all of these gems in one month, we will be able to get 34,880 gems for free. And if you will save these gems for uh, the play sale offers, probably you will get a decent reward. Or even though if you are, you are saving these gems, you can open at least uh, 10, 3,000 gems pack in the Retro Stars event, or you can also save it for the uh, anniversary event uh, daily bundle as well probably that will be 97 to 103 you can spend your gems on that pack and you will get the better reward so now uh, it depends upon you either you want to uh, waste your gems on flash sale or you want to spend them on the anniversary event i just told you the way like how you can do it and after that there are also 2x offers available as well uh, in the gem section but they are not that easy uh, you have to spend a lot of times in uh, these offers but whenever the 2x offer will be available i will tell you like how to make the gems don't worry about it and uh, talking about the coins like either it's easy to make the coins nah it's not easy why uh, because if you will play the events right now like retro stars event probably you will be able to make 6 million to 10 million coins only from this event uh, because here you can see you can get uh, 2, 2 million only from the week one and then there are few coins available in the retro rewards if i show you uh, this section which is giving us 1.5 million so probably 6 million to 10 million coins are free the only way of getting coins uh, from this game is through the division rivals rewards and as you know there will be a division rivals reset as well uh, but it's i think really a long time that there is a division rival rewards for that you have to play versus attack and head to head matches a lot and that will give you universal tokens you can also complete icons chronicle sections and that will give you a lot of uh, uh universal tokens and in the 16 days i will suggest you to get at least ft champion in versus attack head to head or manager mode you will have at least thirty thousand competitive points and try to get uh, advanced competitive points and then open the packs and uh, if you will be lucky you will get a lot of uh, good rewards from these division rivals tradable packs don't go for the untradable packs open tradable packs and i think you will be able to make 50 million to 100 million coins for free uh, in the flash sale uh, before the flash sale or uh, before the anniversary event which will help you to get the good place from the anniversary event and you can also do the investments before the anniversary event or flash sale try to buy some cheap players and then wait for their prices to increase and then sell them when to buy the players as you know in the few days there will be market pick refresh uh, for the selected players and the top event players i would suggest you to wait for that uh, whenever that pack will be available players will open it and there will be a lot of supplies for the players on the market at that time 
buy the place on the lowest prices i will tell you which place to buy at that time right now i'm only giving you like when to invest so you just collect some coins and then make the investments and i think in one month you will have around 200 million 300 million coins which will be enough for the flash sale so i told you about the gems i told you about the coins for the uh sc points you have to be p2p you have to buy the offers uh from the game that's the only way of getting fc points you are not getting any fc points for free so i hope this video will be helpful for you guys we will meet you soon till then bye allah hafiz